Hello Year 9, my name is Mrs Clayton and I'm going to introduce you to a brand new qualification that is starting this September at Werner School and it's called Child Development. The full qualification name is the exam board is the NCFE CASH Level 2 Technical Award in Child Development and Care. The NCFE is the uh, Northern Centre for Education and it's in conjunction with uh, the CASH exam board. The qualification you will receive will be equivalent to one GCSE, but it won't be levels one to nine. It will be graded as pass, merit and distinction. The level two qualification in child development and care is fantastic for those who are looking at working with children in the future. This is not just for female pupils. This is open to both male and females. It is, this is, of course, is fantastic for those looking to get into uh, a medical profession, such as nursing or health and social care, such as support workers, uh, childcare, babysitting, nannying and teaching. For those of you that are looking to develop applied knowledge and practical skills in child development, then this is a fantastic course. It will prepare you for further qualifications at college uh, for level three qualifications in childcare, health and social care, psychology, sociology and biology. So what will you learn in the um, technical award in child development? Well, you need to complete three mandatory units to gain your qualification. The three mandatory units are as follows. Unit one is an introduction to working with children from years uh, zero to five. Unit two is the development and well-being of uh, years zero to five. And unit three is all about childcare and the development of years zero to five. So it's really important that you want to uh, learn about how uh, children uh, form from uh, conception all the way through to the age of year five and how fast they develop during that time. So how will you be assessed in the technical award in child development and care? So over your three units, you've got unit one and unit two will be an externally assessed piece of coursework decided by the exam board. Um, and that will be a coursework that will be done over a period of set time in lessons and it will be internally marked by teachers within the school. Unit three, however, is an externally assessed, uh, an externally set synoptic scenario examination. And these will be short answer questions based on the whole of the course of the three units. Is this qualification right for you and what could this qualification lead to? So this is a fantastic choice for you to gain an understanding of child development and well-being. It's ideal if you want to progress further onto level three early years education qualification. If you like working with children, you might have younger siblings or younger family members and you like doing babysitting now or it's something that you would like to uh, work in in terms of a career in the future is working with uh, young children. Progression to further relevant level two programmes or study or level three programmes at college will also um, give you the opportunity to study further. You may also wish to progress to an apprenticeship route in early years or childcare at either level two or level three. Here are some professions that this qualification could help you to enter should you wish to uh, choose the technical award in childcare. You can move into the nursing profession working for the NHS. You could become a nanny. You could look into becoming uh, a teacher a midwife, a nursery school teacher, you can look at going into social working and also as a health visitor. Here are some of the transferable skills and the qualities that you will develop whilst you are studying for the technical award in childcare and development. 
When studying the course, we will have access to visiting speakers who currently work in child and care settings. We'll also have potential um, visits to early year settings like local nurseries. And also we'll hear from lots of different people who have young children aged between zero and five to make it a real life scenarios uh, and work related. So you'll get lots of opportunities and experiences, which is great preparation for further study and the workplace. So that's it for the information about the course for now. But if you'd like to find out more information, please do come and see me. It's Mrs Clayton. Um, I'm on C55 or you can send me an email on sarah.clayton at wernerschool.com. Thank you.